Hi! Today I will show you another two ornaments from the set of the 12 days of Christmas by Butzilla. And I want to do two turtle doves and three French hens. I already made another video about how I did this partage in a pear tree. So again I will be using instructions and the chart. It's very helpful that we have numbers for the details and I have to start with the detail with the smallest number. And this detail I also have to embroider. And this one I add to have I have to add sequence. And we also have a key page where we can check of about the floss color for the embroidery and about color for the sequence. This sign of heart means that I have to add a red sequence. And for the embroidery I have to use gold floss, so gold metallic. Probably this is the simplest uh, ornament in the whole kit, so I quite quickly added the first uh, three details and this is how my heart looks so far. It's really very easy to sew everything together. Here we have lines where I need to put bodies and wings of the turtle doves, but first I have to embroider them. Again I will check my chart about which color and which stitches I have to use for embroidering wings. And again I will have to use sequence for the bodies and for the wings. I always do first the embroidery, then I add sequins and only then I cut the next detail. So now I have to use gold metallic with one thread and white sequins for the wings. Or you can simply check the cover of the set about the color of the sequins and embroidery. So I did all the stitching and I think that it's really nice to have grey and gold together. On the next step I applique wings to the heart and I use white thread and tiny tiny stitches. And the front part of the heart is almost finished. And it took considerable time to embroider everything, to attach all sequins. But now I am ready to add the back part and to stuff the heart. I am trying to be very precise when I cut details, because I don't want to leave these white lines. And it's also very important to have very nice scissors. Front and back parts are ready. And I will be using for stitching red floss according to the color of the front. I always admire how easy to sew Butzilla kit even for beginners because all details fit together perfectly. 
It's also important to not forget to make hanger and place it between front and back part. And I also decided to embroider and to apply sequins to all pears and all leaves. It will be much, much easier to sew future ornaments. Finally, my second ornament with two turtle doves is finished. As I said, it was one of the easiest in this set. You may notice that I also embroidered their beaks and added beds for the eyes. And now I am ready to make three French hands. Maybe it will be not very interesting, because I have to make three absolutely identical birds, but still, it's a beautiful ornament. And my first step is to apply sequins. But then terrible thing happened. I lost the, the page with the chart, so I wasn't able to continue sewing my French hands. So I decided to go to the uh, Plate website. Plate is the manufacturer who own Bucilla trademark. So I went to the official site. I decided to contact them and describe that I purchased their kit and that I accidentally lost one of the pages and it was a very important page because on this chart I had uh, ornaments from the first till the eight so I wasn't able to make to make a lot of ornaments and I was so disappointed and I really hope that plate will be able to help me. So I wrote them and on the next day they sent me an email and they sent me a scan of the chart and I was absolutely happy. So the customer support of plate Bucilla is wonderful. And now I am able to continue sewing my French hands. On the first day of Christmas my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. On the second day of Christmas my true love gave to me two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. On the third day of Christmas my true love gave to me three French hens, two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. On the fourth day of Christmas my true love gave to me four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the fifth day of Christmas my true love gave to me five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two and a partridge in a pear tree. On the sixth day of Christmas, 
my true love gave to me. Six geese a laying, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the seventh day of Christmas, my true love gave to me seven swans a singing, six geese a laying, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the eighth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me eight maids a milking, seven swans a swimming, six geese a laying. Five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. I finished to make bodies of two hands and I decided to add bed for the eye because Busilla suggested that we use French knot, but I decided that bed will look better. I also almost finished wings and this is the thing which I use for the stuffing. And I also use my brush. I want my stitches to be almost invisible, so I tried to make them as tiny as I could.
you can see here all details I prepared in order to finish this ornament. I also have a French flag here. I just have to decide where to put it. I need to attach leaves and pears and my ornament will be finally finished. Finally, I am very proud to show you the result of my May sewing and I have ornaments number 2 and number 3. I really love both and I am so eager to make next ornaments. I am really happy that in this set I have 12 com completely different ornaments and I really love this Christmas song. So I hope to make a very nice set until the Christmas of this year. I also hope that this video was interesting for you. And remember that it's never early to start Christmas preparations.